Welcome to This Week in Gato, where we take a look at the interesting, the awesome, and the weird things being developed this week in the Gato engine. And let me know in the comments which project featured this week is your favorite. Let the countdown begin. Number eight. Nathan from GD Quest brought Christmas a little early this year with a free open source third person character controller for Gato 4. Based on classic 3D platformers like Jack and Daxter and Ratchet and Clank, the controller is ready to plug into your Gato 4 project with jump, attack, aim, and swap weapon abilities built in. You can grab the free source from GitHub. Number 7. It seems like every month brings a new AI tool making the viral rounds. Chat GPT is this month's internet curiosity with conversational AI dialogue, meaning you can ask it basically anything, including how to write code within Gato. Need a 3D character controller? There are limitations and the code is built from external sources, but as a quick resource for common questions or even weird ones, Chat GPT offers a potentially exciting tool to the Gato game development space. Number six. You find yourself in a situation where it's impossible to get out. Asylum 23 is an Android title built in Gato that offers an interesting and exciting story with classic quests and adventures, simple puzzles for attentiveness and ingenuity, and an abundance of enemies and monsters. Overcome all the puzzles, make the right story decisions, and find your missing sister. Asylum 23 Part 1 Outline 21 is available on Google Play. Number 5. Who needs textures and models when many ASCII characters will do? Benikito showed off this cool ASCII shooter showcasing some clever use of characters to create a top-down shooter boss fight in Gato. The lighting effects work really well with the minimalistic art style that we're honestly craving more of. The style feels different and fresh, despite relying on decades-old computer tech. Until we get more, it might be time to dust off the old Dwarf Fortress. Number 4 Now this is pod racing or high-speed anti-gravity racing. Drive on roller coaster tracks, overtake your opponents, and engage in combat in Fast Track. Fast Track features six different vehicles and three racing modes. Hypersonic, where you race against 14 other opponents at speeds up to 2,000 miles per hour. Hyper Combat, that features intense machines-to-machine -machine combat with plasma weapons and bullets. And a campaign mode consisting of 20 unique levels. Jump in and hit the Fast Track, available on Steam. Number 3 The Omens is a strategy game built in Gato where players must forge factions of omens and use them for conquest. You play as a divine power that is fueled by the success of your followers. Manage your omens to make sure they're happy and healthy, clock in and out at their jobs, and build their skills as they fight for you, their divine leader. With different habitats, resources, and research to unlock, you'll be flexing your divine muscles in no time. The Omens is currently under development on the Gato engine and will feature a Kickstarter in early 2023. Number two. Your adventure begins by navigating your way through the sanctuary of orbs that lie in wait for a ranger to claim. Featuring a maze of twists and turns, Ranger Quest The Adventure Begins places you in a fantasy story full of magic and intrigue. Built by a father and daughter team originally within Microsoft Excel, the game is now living within the Gato engine. Free to download on Steam, Ranger Quest brings back the nostalgia of 80s top-down adventure games with doors to open and rooms to explore. Navigate the maze to find the elemental orbs, piece together a magic map, and find the correct path to solve the puzzle. Number 1 a chain of unfortunate events launches you into a quest of vital importance to all the peace-loving creatures of the realm. Of Blades and Tales is a turn-based RPG that is action-oriented with a touch of strategy. Inspired by games like Diablo and Stone Shard, Of Blades and Tales is an early access and features open-world gameplay, turn-based combat, procedural dungeons and caves, character development and numerous enemies, equipment, and unique items. Dust off your sword and experience Of Blades and Tales on Steam today. For more cool projects being done in Gato, be sure to check out this video here. And I'll be back next week with another This Week in Gato.